Roger Ayers, along with Ramey Stallions and Joe Lindsay, our officiating crew. Roger tosses it into the air, and the Blue Devils, when they're freshman guards, and Mitchell back in the lineup, along with Jeremy Roach, Filipowski inside there, and there is Mitchell making his presence felt almost immediately. Probably overused, but undersold the word continuity. Getting more starting lineup you just saw for Louisville, the eighth different one they've used this season as Curtis Williams makes his first start. And Brandon Huntley Hatfield. And Kenny telling us before the game, if I had five or six yes. Mike James, wouldn't even really care about the positions, we would just go. Letting fly from the corner. And there's a three ball from Curtis Williams, the freshman. One loss coming last time out against Pittsburgh, but under 500 on the road. And there is Mitchell, and Mitchell has both two baskets. Shot clock getting down toward five. Here's Huntley Hatfield working through a couple of Blue Devils and a look for Clark from the corner. And another three ball, and this is not playing for me, John, because I'm all about letting that thing fly. Here's Filipowski on the business the end. Connectedness you're looking for, communication. You have to have communication on the ball, yes, but then jinx him like you right. did. It's okay. So we're already starting with that. You're believing that the announcer jinx. Not going to make a decision based on one game, win or lose, which is a wise way to look at it as the Blue Devils get a three ball from Jared McCain. Feeling like you're not going to be able to turn it around. Yeah, and a place without the history, meaning a place that isn't Louisville, a place that isn't UCLA. Sky Clark gets another one. Here, progress is wins. Yep. That's the hardest thing, progress is outcome. Tyrese Proctor back into the game, or into the game for the first time. Winning teams at Kentucky, certainly, and at Oregon as well. Has a great wow. love for this place. But he has to be aggressive, right? He has to just consider the weapons and use the space that he has. Huntley Hatfield can't finish off a really good feed from Clark. I'm telling you, Proctor and Jeremy Rhodes, this is too easy. What a pass wow. from Filipowski, who's an excellent passer for a big man. And well, defense has been a problem for Louisville from time to time. And Filipowski finds Mitchell. It's four dunks already. Looking to Williams, here's Trey White. Transfer from USC. Pull up at the bucket. And Trey White's been really good since coming back from injury. Proctor getting a piece of the paint, and Tyrese Proctor has showed up to play tonight. Pulls it away, and here come the Cardinals. Sky Clark has been off to a good start tonight. Good offensive follow. Huntley Hatfield with the bucket. Sky Clark sporting a new do yeah. tonight. It's a different look. It's worked well for it. He'll continue on if he keeps his pace up. He's already hit a couple of threes. Now Duke swings it to Mitchell. Louisville much more active on defense than they have been early. Proctor has a look from three, and he buries it. And on the baseline, Tyler Johnson, the freshman, scoring. Proctor, again, Tyrese Proctor. That's something I think Duke could do very well. But Proctor... Found his man in the corner and Rhodes knocked it down so far tonight. Uh, nine assists, only three turnovers. Clark misses. Philip Housey got shoved in the back. No call, and Huntley Hatfield's there to put it back. Are you inviting me? Is that a, if you'd like to uh, come? Sure. Always welcome. Pay your own dollar. Dollar. <laughs> Jeremy Roach knocks down the three. And if Roach. you have this kind of space, I mean, what are you going to do? The other thing that's coming is, is a skip to the corner. So you've got skip to the corner. There's another skip. Foster's back into the game. You know, it was about this point a little bit earlier in the first half against Wake Forest Saturday that Wake went on a three-point shooting barrage. McCain has his pocket picked by Johnson from behind. James almost stepped out of bounds on the sideline. There's a strong move from the freshman Johnson. And Louisville... Trying to go on a mini run here. James lines up a three, and there it is. The quick 7-0 spurt from the Cardinals. It looks came too easy. They got to move it a little bit, create a good rhythm, and start to build something again here to close out the first half. And there's Mitchell Strong, and one. And just go to work. No help, really no dig down. That's just going to be too easy for Mark Mitchell. When's the last time he said that? Took the red shirt. <laughs> yeah. Fought the, NCAA, fought the NCAA and got eligibility. That's what they did. Huntley Hatfield. Well, this is what I want to see what Duke does. I mean, where do you get to what you like? That, that's 
Yeah, that's a good shot. Hard to say no to that. Missed that loss to Pittsburgh if combined for 22 points in the first half. Sky Clark finds nice a little shot. room. He's grimacing a bit. Clark finds a little room. Huntley Hatfield knocks down the mid-range jumper. Clark finds wide open. Try it again from the corner. Nice. This time he's got it. Trey White. Taken or made that many threes, and the percentage not that great. Filipowski wipes away the shot of Curtis Williams. But you can still earn that. And I'm going to tell you, they're, they're more apt to call that because of what they took away at the rim. Nice. There's White scoring his second straight bucket. What Shire was talking about, showing maturity when a team makes a run at you, and it's the type of thing that Louisville needs to kind of be a cornerstone and a building block. You chase on one end, you force on the other. That, that's kind of what it's been here to start the second as Louisville just continues to pick them apart. Just a tremendous look from James to beat that double team. And they can pull off a game like this, it will go a long way toward alleviating some of it. Shot clock right at the end. And Clark gets the bucket. It's a three-point game. But stop. I mean, good defense from Duke. Almost, I should say. But really, Scott Clark just made a tough shot. And when you game aggressive Louisville team, here's Williams. Good look to White. White puts it up. Huntley Hatfield with a follow. Filipowski well, tries to quiet the crowd. Proctor will try it. He's got a break for Duke. Just accepting that perspective has something to do with it. Yeah. Mitchell. Don't you very much. All right, so Duke got back. Bill holding them off, and here's Mitchell. And there, two stay with the basketball, just kind of roll to the basket, easy. On his three of nine. There's White driving, and scoring three, White. Guy Clark defending that roll, man, and Proctor goes right down the boulevard. Tyrese Proctor has 16. Now here's James. Sky Clark driving again, gives it up to Huntley Hatfield. Excellent ball movement. Filipowski using that pivot foot brilliantly, and Kyle Filipowski. Opportunity for Louisville to continue one of his strong suits and drive the basketball. A strong suit for the Blue Devils tonight has been the play of Tyrese Proctor. Probably a little bit better, or at least have a better feel for the game because of that. A lot of high school kids don't develop that until you get to college because you finally start playing with shot clocks. Proctor to the bucket again. Tyrese Proctor scores again. Nine point lead for Duke. But James thought about it now. He'll go right to the bucket. Shot clock under 10. James finds room. Telling you. Just clear and let him put it on the deck. Here's Proctor as we head toward the seven minute mark. Proctor, got step it. back and another bucket. He's got a career high. When Duke needed a Tyrese Proctor. Yeah, that little, was really big. We could have put something. two really good clips together. A little bit of a youthful mistake yeah. there from Williams, the freshman. Ooh. Proctor puts people on the deck and can't get the shot to fall. And is tipped up and in. Filipowski to work. Wow. Filipowski to left wow. hand. And the follow for Kyle. Use Huntley Hatfield, but if he's just going to occupy the block, it actually hurts you. Guy Clark uses the window in the field goal. Drought's over, and they're back to within nine. There's a little crowd behind us really <laughs> giving it to the officials about that last one. McCain from That's the corner, big. and a big shot. Yep. Hand off to McCain, turns the corner. McCain to the bucket, wow. he scores again. He's made a couple yeah. of big ones here to <laughs> score a portion of the development yet. Lepowski all the way. Clark. Huffley Hatfield has it back, and he'll get a chance for a three-point play. And the Blue Devils are going to go back to Durham with a 83-69 win.